Did you know that American alligators are among the first reptiles recorded to use tools? They have been documented balancing small sticks and branches on their heads to attract birds looking for nesting materials. This behavior is shared with the mugger crocodile from India. I'm your host, Romika Sanino, and I'm a conservation scientist, writer, and photographer. Every week, we'll be introducing you to new animals caught on camera traps around the world. Don't forget to subscribe to Mongave to get new videos delivered directly to your inbox. The American alligator is a large crocodilian reptile endemic to the southeastern United States. This species is the official state reptile of three U.S. states, Florida, Louisiana, and Mississippi. The American alligator inhabits freshwater wetlands such as marshes and cypress swamps from Texas to southern and coastal North Carolina. The American alligator is distinguished from the sympatric American crocodile by its broader snout and darker coloration. It is also less tolerant of salt water, but more tolerant of cooler climates than the American crocodile. In fact, the American alligator is found further from the equator than the American crocodile. When the water begins to freeze, American alligators go into a period of dormancy known as brumation. They slow down their metabolism and their breathing, and before the surface ice is over, they stick their snouts out of the water to continue breathing. As American alligators may continue to grow throughout their lives, the oldest individuals are usually the largest. The biggest one reached a size of 4.6 meters, that's about 15 feet in length, and weigh 453 kilograms. However, the average length for males is about 3.4 meters and weigh up to 360 kilograms. Females are smaller, measuring around 3 meters in length. American alligators are a keystone species because they modify wetland habitats. They create holes which provide both wet and dry habitats for other organisms. This helps especially in flat areas such as the Everglades because alligator holes become an oasis during the Everglades dry season. Also, when alligators stick, they make a buildup of soil towards the periphery of the holes, which provides drier areas for other reptiles to nest and a place for plants that are intolerant of inundation to colonize. American alligators are apex predators that occasionally prey on large mammals, such as deer, but usually eat fish, amphibians, reptiles, birds, and smaller mammals. The American alligator is listed as least concerned by the IUCN. Next week, we'll be meeting an animal that sleeps less than two hours a day and fights with its neck. Tell us in the comments if you know what animal it is. See you next week.